Good morning. The thing that's on my mind this morning is how often we talk ourselves out of living our dream lives. Yep. We decide that we simply don't have time to start our business, take care of our health, or do the other things that we know we need to do in order to create the life of our dreams. This morning, I had some appointments and I thought, ah, oh, shoot, you know, I don't have time to do my walk. Oh, well, I guess I won't do it. Well, you know what? I didn't have time to do a four and a half mile walk. That is true, but I did have 45 minutes so I could do a much shorter walk. And for some reason, it never occurred to me that a short walk could be a way to start my day. When I was on my walk, I was thinking about how often we do this. We have a big vision in mind. We have a huge end goal in mind. And if we can't do all of it right now, today or this week, we think that we can't get it done. Our dreams come true one step at a time. They're not big leaps. And if you can't do the big things today that are going to create your dream life, what are the small steps you can take? Could you not scroll social media for 15 minutes and take one single action that's gonna get you closer to your dream life? This is how we build businesses. Every single business that you see out there was a small idea and the founder had to take a small step. Every big name you see speaking on a keynote stage did that through small steps. Mel Robbins didn't work up, wake up one morning booking gigs in front of thousands of people and earning tens or hundreds of thousands of dollars. She took small steps and you can take those small steps too. Don't let the idea that you don't have enough time stop you from creating your dream life. Taking small steps, this is how we rise.